I'm going to be trying 10 healthy habits for a day. I've seen a lot of influencers do this where they try it for like a week. I decided just to try it for a day and just like see how it goes. I wrote down on my phone like 10 healthy habits. I just found some on Pinterest and stuff like that. The first one is waking up early at 7 a.m. or just 8 a.m., 6 a.m., whatever time it is. Just so that I can have energy throughout the day, especially to do all of these habits and just be like productive and stuff like that. Second is not being on the phone in the morning. Obviously, that's a struggle, but when I'm waking up early, I just don't go on the phone at all, I feel like. So I won't be like an issue for me. Staying hydrated, so just drinking plenty of water. I have like this wa big water bottle that I got for Christmas and I just drink out of that and I'm gonna be trying to like drink three at least, three bottles of that. Getting some movement, so whether that be doing yoga or walking or working out, whether that be anything. Practicing gratitude, so that's just journaling, meditating, doing yoga or anything, just like journaling, stuff like that. Like just saying what I'm grateful for or just spending time just sitting down thinking about all the things that I'm grateful for. On my daily life, I also try to do that, just practicing gratitude, so that's just like journaling and stuff like that. So I'm gonna be doing that more in this video. Eating nutritious meals, so that's like like healthy snacks, healthy food, all the greens, like just green food, just so that I can maintain like my energy levels. Reducing screen time. So for me, I just edit a lot. I edit for like eight hours. I don't get out of bed. It's just like, it's just really unhealthy. So I'm just gonna be setting myself like a timer, like whether that be like an hour or less than that just so that I can focus on my health and my like being like literally when you're editing you don't eat like at least for me so I'm just gonna be trying to reduce that like screen time taking vitamins which is obviously so important I am gonna be showing you guys like the vitamins that I take cleaning so that could be doing laundry or cleaning like deep cleaning my room because I just came back from a trip so cleaning my mirrors my floor my tables just wiping down everything because especially with germs and like not trying to get sick like just dust is something that I need to keep out of my room for because like I struggle with having dust in my room so that's probably the type of cleaning I'll be doing hopefully this video motivates you guys to do the same thing because I definitely think being aware of like what you're doing and what you're putting in your body and what time you're sleeping and all that stuff is so important especially if you want to get better mentally and physically like it's just so important so I am going to be sharing my thoughts at the end of this video of what I think about this overall make sure you subscribe and let's get on to the video video and I could not get up this morning. I know I say this to like every video when I get up early but I literally couldn't. I tried to film this yesterday and failed to wake up but we actually did it this morning. I'm going to go on a trail for my like physical activity. Not like physical activity but for like some movement. So I'm getting ready for that. I'm just going to do my skincare. I feel like this is the perfect like challenge for me because I just got back from a trip. If you guys didn't know and usually when you get back from a trip you're super exhausted and you just want to lay in bed and you don't want to unpack you don't want to do anything and that's me right now my room is a mess I just need to clean it and just challenging myself to do these like habits waking up early is just gonna motivate me to do everything that I need to do after you like finish your whole trip you know what I mean like I haven't done the basics I'm feeling even more worse because my boyfriend had to go back to PA and me and him do long distance so it just doesn't like feel good right now to just like be up and doing things but I'm just like pushing myself today to do everything I've literally just been in bed editing and that's it I already feel 10 times better that I got up like it's literally an accomplishment for me to like actually get out of bed and like I, I don't know I just feel so good right now even though it was like hard to get out of bed So when I woke up this morning, I didn't go on my phone, which is like not really an accomplishment because I don't usually go on my phone most of the times so if I'm waking up early. Like I'm not going to waste my time on my phone when I literally just spent more minutes sleeping. I could have been on my phone, so it's not, honestly not that hard for me. If I'm going to be honest with you guys, I kept expanding the time for me to like wake up early, like get out of bed. I kept staying like a couple more minutes. That's why I woke up like a little bit later than like actually like 6 a.m. But I still woke up early. Like I'm still going to give myself that credit, but... It 
it was definitely hard to like wake up right on the dot like i could not get up that's definitely something i need to challenge myself doing but i feel like it's not that big of a deal like if you're already waking up early just like be proud of yourself because that's also a big struggle that everybody struggles with most of the people like i'm not a morning person so i just can't get myself to waking up early i'm doing something very minimal today because i'm planning to go to trader joe's after my hike but usually i don't wear makeup i just want to wear something the trail is just to watch like the sunrise and i'm just really excited because i went before i left for my trip and it was literally one of my favorite walks but this time i'm gonna go with my friend so you guys will probably see her oh my god i literally have to leave in like 10 minutes it's close to my house it's like eight minutes away so that's good but i definitely want to catch the summer while i do my makeup i'm gonna listen to this playlist that i just recently made it's called transitioning into summer and i added some new songs that i just recently found and i'm just like so excited for summer that i already made a summer playlist and i made this just because like different songs different title i don't know that doesn't make sense but whatever i'm trying to go fast you guys but my brain can't physically do that right now falling all over the place but i'm drinking this full thing this morning i'm not gonna chug it before i go just because i'm like so bad at chugging stuff and i'm literally late the sunrise is at 6 50 but i don't see any sun actually i do i think there's sun out there but anyways i'm gonna drink this whole thing on my walk i'm gonna try to so i'm gonna bring this like little bag with me which i got from princess polly it's super cute anyways let's go before i go i want to show you guys this outfit that i'm wearing this top is from revol and these shorts are from lululemon i'm wearing like a tank top underneath i'm probably gonna take it off because every time i go on a trail like i get so hot and then for shoes i'm wearing these old ugly pair of vans they're literally like one of my old shoes from middle school that i would wear like every day but i need new ones like even though they're old like an old shoe trend they're literally still my favorite because they just match with everything all right on the way now so good right now i walked so much like i'm exhausted right now i got really good pictures though i am obsessed with it it was just overall a really good walk the whole time i was drinking from my water bottle i have like a little bit left um so that's good but we're gonna now drive to tropical smoothie and then go to trader joe's to get some stuff and i'm gonna show you guys what i get <laughs> Ginger juice and apple cider vinegar. In it. So we're gonna try the Aura collagen tea. Actually, it tastes like lemon. <laughs> yeah, now it was just cute though. I feel like I could get used to it, but it's not. Something oh, it just I, keeps getting for worse. the the price i don't think i'd want to get used to. so i got a room spray i got watermelon and these gone bananas so they're just like chocolate covered frozen bananas and then i got gume gume oh mint flavors gum. oh gum <laughs> gume I Okay, I'm back home, and I want to give you guys a haul of what I got at Trader Joe's. First things first, I got this tulip right when I walked in. I was like, I need new flowers. So I decided to get these yellow tulips, and I think they're so, like, spring and, like, summer vibe. I got green beans. Obviously, this Aura collagen tea, which I give it, like, a five. I don't really like it that much, but I think the bottle is really cute. That's why I got it. And also, it's really healthy, and the whole point of this video also is just to eat healthy foods, healthy, like, nutrition and stuff like that. As you guys know, this 
this is like a 10 healthy habits video and one of the healthy habits is to obviously eat healthy so that's why I got green beans I got cucumber this whey protein powder and it's vanilla and I just thought like I do make smoothies and I have been wanting to do it with like vanilla protein or something just like different other than like chocolate because I just don't like chocolate with my protein shakes it just doesn't taste that good so I feel like this one's gonna taste good and it has 20 grams of protein and 110 calories got this fruit frenzy bars and it's like a raspberry lemon strawberry one and it just looks so good like I'm literally craving this right now but we're not gonna eat this yet because I need to eat other stuff this will be later last thing I got is this very green juice smoothie and it's super healthy it has banana mango and kiwi with apple and pineapple juice green foods and other green ingredients which this is obviously super health healthy so I'm gonna be having this also today but yeah that's everything I got I'm still drinking my smoothie that I got from tropical smoothie and I try to get something really healthy and it definitely did fill me up I'm like a super Super full it has chicken in it it was like a strawberry little wrap and it was amazing <laughs> with you guys my room does not look cute it's not looking good like i just took a couple of things out of my room and it was solely just because it was one of the habits to clean my room and set a timer for one hour but ever since i got back from my trip it's been bad like i just haven't had the time to clean my room obviously because i'm still in like a travel mood like i just am sad that like my boyfriend left and we do long distance so i don't know when i'm gonna see him next there's so much other stuff so i think this is the perfect opportunity to clean my room i'm gonna be deep cleaning it and i'm also gonna do some laundry because i have been putting that off. I made myself a matcha. I forgot to put sweetener in it. I usually add vanilla sweet syrup and it's so good. So I'm basically just going to be wiping my tables, wiping my mirrors down and doing some laundry because I have been putting it all off ever since I got back from my trip. Obviously, I'm going to put these things off. I don't want to get to it and I just need to get back into the routine of cleaning every week. So I feel like this is going to be like the perfect opportunity. I'm also going to be setting an hour timer for me to clean. Usually I can finish before an hour. So we'll see how that goes. My room is looking really bad like a second ago but i just took down an old flower that was over there that caleb gave me when he was here and then i also took all the boxes down that was like on this that's pretty much it i really need to vacuum my floors they're disgusting and also my tables like i can see literal dust on it here's what the room is looking like my bed is obviously unmade we don't talk about that i really want to clean just like my shelves and then i don't know what that towel is doing over there it's really just organizing stuff like i need to take stuff off of there i don't know like it's just random stuff and i also need to deep clean this table so yeah, it's not like terrible, but I feel like it doesn't feel clean to me like my floors and everything So we're just gonna deep clean everything
cooking up green beans and I'm also making rice with it. I'm probably gonna add some tomatoes with it too, but that's gonna be after. And I've been getting so much better with cooking. I'm just now learning how to make green beans, but like I feel like they're just super easy to make. I just don't have like garlic, which is what people like usually do. But anyways, I am super excited about the rice because Nobody made rice, like my mom didn't make rice this week, so I decided just to make rice, and I'm gonna surprise her. But yeah, that's pretty much my dinner for tonight. Also, we're adding some healthy foods. We're cooking up the green beans, so we add some healthy stuff, and I'm gonna add also tomato, and I wanna make a smoothie after this, too. I go to sleep i do want to do some yoga because one of them were to practice gratitude so it's either doing yoga meditation or like journaling which i'm probably going to do like all of them i want to do meditation really badly because i haven't been doing that recently but i have been doing yoga recently so if you don't do yoga i definitely recommend just going on your laptop searching up like night yogas or morning stretch yogas or if you have scoliosis which is something that i struggle with then searching up like scoliosis yoga and i literally definitely recommend doing it in the morning is so nice too because you just woke up like not going on your phone and then going straight to doing yoga is so nice also at night because you're literally just going to sleep after that and you just can fall asleep way faster when you do yoga because it calms your mind down especially if you're an overthinker or if you think a lot of things all at the same time yeah i'm gonna remove my makeup and brush my teeth and stuff like that I am gonna take my vitamins but I want to show you guys what I take because a lot of you guys ask me like what I take and I do show them in my videos but I want to show them again for people that haven't seen it and obviously one of the habits were to take vitamins so I take these at night I just recently bought ashwagandha which is for stress and like anxiety and I just took this this morning so I've been taking this in the morning I feel like it helps a lot but I have to take it more regularly to give you guys like a more better outlook on this so every night I take magnesium now which is good for the muscle bone support i take biotin which is for hair skin and nails clear skin probiotics which i got from amazon and i feel like this is honestly really really good um some people obviously have a different effect to it like my boyfriend actually took this for one day and he got super dizzy so definitely research before you take it some people obviously are going to react differently to this so any one of these are, you're literally going to react to it differently so definitely do your research before you get any of this and and then I definitely recommend taking vitamin C. So I take that last, which just supports immune health. I use this organizer that I got from Amazon too. I'll have a link down below, but it just organizes everything for like the days. I feel like a mom or like a dad taking vitamins, like because my dad used to have this like, ever since I was seven. I just realized like I'm literally turning into him, but definitely taking your supplements is just so important, especially if you're taking vitamin C, just stuff like that, just for your health. And I love taking all of these it's just really good for all of that so we're gonna take these i have to refill this like put more in here because there's literally nothing anymore i took the last one for tuesday which today is tuesday so i'm gonna refill all of this real quick <laughs> and like what I think about this and everything like just how it went I definitely recommend doing this like just setting 10 habits for you to like look forward to every day and that could be like if you have school do it if you don't have school and you have like the weekends off and you want to like go on a trail in the morning wake up early watch the sunrise drink a lot of water eat your green all that stuff then you can do it like you definitely can do it I for sure loved the idea of following 10 healthy habits like literally I feel
feel so clean right now i woke up early i did some meditation yoga i went on a trail for like an hour and 30 minutes i drank so so much water like i literally had to pee so badly when i went into tropical smoothie like after i finished paying i literally ran to the bathroom which was like kind of like the worst part of drinking a lot of water because i always have to pee like i have a small bladder i always have to pee so that's like kind of like what sucks but i know that i'm benefiting a lot from drinking so much water so i definitely recommend even if you don't drink water do it like you want clear skin drink water i would say the only challenge that i definitely struggled with was waking up at 7 a.m i think that was like the hardest thing ever because no not 7 a.m 6 a.m i woke up at 6 a.m to watch the sunrise especially when you're not a morning person and i'm not a morning person when it comes to getting up but after i'm out of bed and like going to the gym or whatever like if i'm going on a trail it literally feels so good and that's when i like become a morning person i'm like damn i'm so proud of myself like literally i feel so good like after I, like what i was saying in the morning like i was just so proud of myself and i felt so good i definitely recommend doing this i saw other people do this for a week like trying 10 habits for a week and i really really want to try that because i feel like if i do this for a whole week then i will feel super clean like i'm feeling right now and i will just feel like super motivated and productive and proud of myself especially for waking up early because i definitely struggled with waking up early like i said hopefully this motivated you guys to try this as well it's currently like 9 p.m right now and i'm gonna go to sleep and one of the habits were to get enough sleep so sleep early and so tonight that's what we're doing we're going to sleep oh yeah also another reason why i feel clean is because i clean my entire room i just didn't do laundry just because i can just do it tomorrow like i feel like it was too much on my plate anyways comment down below the apple emoji if you made it up to this point make sure you subscribe and let me know what videos you guys would want to see from me on my channel make sure to go follow my instagram if you're not already i've been posting a lot more on there and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys